In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the trig function values for 60 degrees. So there's a triangle that you can use to come up with all of these values. So it looks like this. And this is a right triangle. So this is 90 degrees. This here is 60 degrees. And this angle here is 30 degrees. Note that if you add up all of the angles inside, you are going to get um, 180 degrees. So that, that does occur. So this here is 1, this is 2, and this is 3. So it's 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. And using um, this triangle and a couple other things, we can find all of the trig function values. So the other thing we need for this is so ka toa. So ka toa. So using this, we can come up with trig function values. So let's see. Sine of 60 degrees is going to be opposite over hypotenuse. So opposite of 60 is the square root of 3 here. So square root of 3. And the hypotenuse is this one. It's 2. So square root of 3 over 2. How about cosecant of 60? Well, cosecant of 60, that's the reciprocal of sine. So you just flip this one. So 2 over square root of 3. So once you have the sine function, you can find the cosecant just by flipping it. And you can rationalize if you want, but I'll leave it. Cosine of 60 degrees. That's going to be adjacent over hypotenuse. So adjacent to 60 is 1. So 1, and then the hypotenuse is 2. The reciprocal of cosine is secant. It's the one that starts with the other letter. So secant of 60. And you just flip it, so you get 2 over 1, which is just 2. Then we have the tangent of 60 degrees. This is so ka toa, oa, so it's opposite over adjacent. So opposite here, you see, is the square root of 3. And adjacent is 1, so you just get the square root of 3, right? Opposite over adjacent. And the very last one is cotangent. So you just take the tangent function and you flip it. So this is really a square root of 3 over 1. So when you flip it, you just get 1 over root 3. So if you ever have to find all of them, you could do this. This is an easy way to do it. Just remember 1, 2, 3, put a square root, 60, 30. If you memorize this triangle, you can also do the ones for 30 degrees as well. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.